All right, well, a little quick reintroduction for the VOD. Hello, everybody, I'm Coles with the Buckberry, and welcome back to the Game of Gauntlet number 41, Cuphead, a deal with the devil, or whatever the subtitle is. Continuing our simply never-ending journey to beat all of my Steam games and continuing our four-week-long special playing the games that you guys have gifted to me. Thank you all so much for being so awesome. Let's get to, let's start a new one. Cuphead. Timer goes. Now this was a notoriously hard platformer slash shooter, kind of in the style of reminiscent of Contra. Finish. If you pick easy, you can't finish the game. It ends early. That's fine. No vertical jump shoot. Yuck shoot switch weapon. Lock, dash. <laughs> I love this. I'm so glad I finally get to experience this game. Yeah, we'll do it on normal. Once upon a time in a magical place called Inkle Island, there were two brothers named Cuphead and Mugman. They lived without care under the watchful eye of the wise Elder Kettle. One day, the two boys wandered far from home, and despite the other kills, many warnings ended up on the wrong side of the tracks and entered the Devil's Casino. Inside, Cuphead and Mugman soon found themselves on a winning streak at the craft table. Hot dog! exclaimed King Dice, the casino sleazy manager. These fellows can't lose. Dice Run boys laughed a newcomer. The brothers gasped it was the casino's owner, the devil himself. Now, how about we raise the stakes? He suggested a toothy grin. Win one more roll and all the loot in my casino is yours, devil fool. But if you lose, I'll have your souls. Deal. Cuphead, blinded by easy riches, nodded and grabbed the dice from throw. Good gosh, Cuphead, no, cried Bugman, for he understood the danger, but it was too late. Snake eyes, laughed the devil while slamming the floor. You lose. The brothers troubled and fear as he loomed over them. Now, how about those souls? Bros pleaded for their very lives. There must be another way to repay you, Bugman stammered. Yes, please, Mr. Cuphead added. Perhaps there is, the devil snickered. Pull out a parchment. I have here a list of my runaway debtors. Collect their souls for me, and I might just pardon you two bugs. Now get going, the devil roared, kicking the boys out most rudely. You have till midnight tomorrow to collect every one of those souls, otherwise I'll be the one collecting yours. Cuphead and Mugman were terribly frightened and ran away as fast as they could. Come on, Mug, can Cuphead. We have to find out the kettle. He'll know what to do. Pickle, you boys have gotten yourselves into. I know you don't want to be pawns of the devil, but if you refuse, I can't bear to imagine your face. You must play along for now, collect those contracts, and you best be ready for some nasty business. Your dead or friends won't be very friendly once you confront them. In fact, I expect they'll transform into terrible beasts. Take this potion so, you, so they won't hang out to, so they won't hang you out to dry. Maybe give the most remarkable magical abilities. Now go to my writing desk and use the mystic inkwell there. You need to prepare yourself for a scrap. Oh. Why is jump and shoot? Interesting. Interesting. A is jump and shoot at the same time. Oh wait, I forgot. This is the this is like that notorious bit from the, the demo that the journalist was playing. 
They were like, eh, ah, you know. The instructions are clearly right there. Trolls. Job for Senator. There we go. Yeah, shoes B. Why is it shooting at the same time? I guess it's not a bad thing to shoot at the same time, but there might be times where I don't want it to shoot, so I'd rather just have it separated. Why is it? I mean, he's not bound to anything else. Unless that's what it's supposed to be. Oh, you know what? You're right. I might. I don't. You are right. I might. No. No, I don't have my keybinding software open. Let's see if we let's just finish the tutorial and then if I need to I can just reload um we'll get through. Divide your dead pal with well time parry on his ghost well too clear. I still don't know why shoot and jump are bound to the same button. That doesn't make any sense. It doesn't look like it is, but... <laughs> I just need to reload the game. now. See if that fixes it. Well, the pen and his cowboy man, they like 
to roll the dice. By chance they came. Interesting. Hey, fellas, looks like you're in for it now, eh? Well, I used to be the same way, always getting in trouble, running, jumping, shooting. But now I prefer to just stroll around and go into the pictures. But hey, let me give you a hand. Take this. Rides and Long range, but below average damage, no aiming required. Extra hit points. Lightly weakens your attack power. Spread. Short range, but great damage if you can keep close to your target. Great coverage with average damage, aim backward for maximum range. You will not take damage during a dash. A great defensive maneuver. Oof. Hmm. I'm kind of tempted to go spread, but I think Chaser is what the speedrunners use, so I feel like that's the smart pick. Cryptos you purchase them if you want to use them. Let's take your equip card. What is this? Oh, is this a boss? What the? Why is my dash this also bound to? Why? Mm, what is with these controls? My dash and my switch weapons are also on the same freaking button. There's a funny ghost of Patch out where swapping weapons quickly allowed you to base it. Be firing both guns at all times. <laughs> Sure, let's restore the defaults. Maybe that'll do something. I don't know what's going on here. Is the keyboard binding like messing with it? I don't know what the hell. I don't have anything else. No, there's something else bound here. Nothing else going on. Jump and special are bound to the same button. Jump and shoot are bound to the same button. The only buttons that aren't dual bound is shoot, my regular shoot button, my lock button, and my directionals. 
dash and... I can do dash separately, but my switch button is also bound to my dash button. What the hell is going on here? Reinstall time? Maybe. I don't know what the hell is going on. Uh, weird. Uh, I might have to use my keybind software. Yeah, I might, I might have to do a real suggest. I might have to just unbuy the controller, then use the keyboard software. <laughs> Alright, so hold on. Where is my keyboard software? Maybe they have a Cuphead profile I can download. That's the nice thing about this one software I use. You can download pre-made profiles that other people have made. Assuming they exist. So I might just be able to find a Cuphead profile online and use that. Although it shouldn't take me long to set it up. We can also make our own new profile. I didn't have this thing running during Cuphead, so... Switch weapons, C for lock. Sadina Curry. Alright. So now what we're gonna do. Remove the controller. Maybe player. T no. <laughs> what the hell? No, I don't want player two. Although this, this control him simultaneously. This could be. Quite the hack. Okay. 
<laughs> totally got this. Okay. Oh god damn it. Why is it Did it automatically No oh, god. It's the wait, no. Remove Flurge. It's de it's detecting the control. Now it thinks. No, remove. God damn it. Now it thinks the controller is another player. God damn it. Well, I guess I can't use that. I just have to reinstall the game. Or we could play like this. <laughs> we just broke it more. Okay, well, I think we're just gonna cut stream here and we will officially start Cuphead uh, probably tonight once I figure out the controller bindings. <laughs> uh, so I might just reinstall the game, see if that fixes it. Uh, take care, everybody. Have a good day. Uh, hopefully tonight we'll be back with Cuphead when we get a few technical issues sorted.